We're here with Pedro Lopez, a star soccer player here at Greater Lawrence. Pedro, obviously you love the game. As no, uh, as we could see with your injury, talk about what happened. Uh, I was playing in the game against Minuteman High School, where I was one on one with the goalkeeper, and I jumped over him, and on the fall, I broke my wrist, and kept me out for the rest of the half. But I came back in the second half. Any thought of missing time? It was just a scare that my season was over at the moment. Gotcha. Now I know you've played out, you've played keeper and you've played forward. Obviously you must have a preference. Oh, I love playing on the field. What it's, is it about that, you know, tell, you're a goal scorer. Talk about what it's like when you have that scoring opportunity. It's, it's something you can't explain. It's, you're on the field and it's the vision in a player to just kick the ball, find his open spot and look at the position of the keeper. It's just being there at the right time. I know your dad passed away a few years ago. How much, when you play, is it motivate you for him? My dad always taught me that on the field, it's nothing more important than the game at task. So in the game, I think of nothing more than just what's our priority to do that game, win the game, what's best for the team. So is that your, almost like your tribute to your dad on a daily basis? That's my tribute to my dad. My dad taught me that at a young age, and I'm a keep using that as I grow up. You hear Dick Coakley, the head boys soccer coach here at Great Lawrence. I mean, certainly when you get a kid who scored 93 goals, he certainly knows, Pedro certainly knows what he's doing on the pitch. Uh, yes, he, uh, he does like to score his goals. Is he one of these kids you can tell right away he had that touch? Yeah, what happened when he was a freshman, he was our, our best keeper and our best scorer. So then you have a problem. You know, do you put him in the uh, the goal and you get a 0-0 tie? Or do you put him outside the goal and get a 2-1, 3-2 uh, loss? Because we have a hard time finding our keepers where we are. As far as, as a player, I mean, is he the type of kid who does a little of everything when you've asked? Uh, yeah, yeah, for, for the most part. He's a, he's a strong off offensive mind player, so he likes to... Uh, he likes to score, okay. Um, we're hoping when he goes to college, he becomes a more rounded player, and it will make him a, a better one. He can play all phases of the game.